uh, it's very important to start to do something about peace. Mm -hmm. So uh, what inspired you? Uh, I mean, your moment is really very inspiring for all of us. Uh, what do you recommend in order to raise awareness uh, among the people so that they, are, they will be eager to uh, get active for peace? How can we uh, urge people to work for peace? Yeah, I think um, a lot of people have no idea what they can do. They think it's, you know, the politicians, they just yeah. decide, and the leaders, and I, people have no idea how they can um, uh, support. And they think, uh, sort of all over the world, you see that people think peace, you know, we bring it to politicians or diplomats yeah. or um, maybe to world leaders. Mm -hmm. yes. But yeah. if you speak with world leaders and mm -hmm. politicians and diplomats and NGOs, the first they say is we can only be effective if the normal people show that they want us to do this. If normal people on the street mm -hmm. get involved, yeah. otherwise change will never happen. Yes, yes. And um, now, and how can we involve the average guy on the street by using music mm -hmm. and art and, uh, and media That's and do something media. positive. Yeah. So yeah. the first thing is um, that we must understand that, that it's about inspiration and coming in the yes. hearts of the people. Secondly, it is that we give people an opportunity to do something because they cannot directly come up with nice things themselves, but okay, on the website, all right, already now, you can find mm. uh, hundreds of initiatives um, started mm. by people all over the world. And so if you don't have an idea for yourself, you can say, okay, I support an in initiative of somebody else. And um, let me tell you what we are organizing. Um, on the International Day of Peace, do you know when the International Day of Peace is? It's an interesting question. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm taking your I'm role now. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know? It? No, remind us. Do you know? No, no. Hmm? I heard. Yeah. I heard but you don't know? I don't know. No. Exactly and and that's one of the reasons why we exist. It's the 21st of September. It's uh, by the United Nations. They say this is the International Day of Peace. Mm -hmm. But generally, all over the globe, only 6% of the people know. Mm -hmm. So I think you can do two things. Or you stop the crap, or you make it laughed. Mm -hmm. And I think we must make this day laughed yeah. and used this day yeah, all yeah. over the world mm. to ask attention for peace building mm. and uh, reach out to people and make them more active. Mm. 21st so of September, The right? 21st of September. Oh, okay. And on the 21st of September in 2014, mm -hmm. we will organize the most heartwarming peace concert ever mm -hmm. um, alongside the pyramids in Cairo and maybe also here in, uh, in Turkey, we can talk about it. Mm -hmm. Um, but we think those two countries are crucial in yes. keeping East and West together. Yes. So yes. that's why we are mm -hmm. here also. Mm -hmm. And um, then we want to um, bring on one stage together artists from all the main um, yeah, areas of tension. Conflict. We call them focus areas, sometimes conflict okay. areas. So think about the number one artist from the North and the South Sudan. Uh, mm. China, Tibet, mm. Russia, Chechenia, mm. Um, mm. maybe mm. even also uh, a, a Turkish Israeli. and a Kurdish uh, yeah. art, artist uh, just to singing together mm. and talking about togetherness and unity and positivity and finding a way forward. Mm. Um, uh, Serbia, Kosovo, um, uh, Iran, Israel. Iran and Israel. Yeah. How about that? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and sometimes we say music can do what words cannot achieve. Yes. Uh, mm politicians, they are only repeating themselves. No. Um, they are only talking about their own truths. Mm -hmm. But artists can find a way to reach out to the opponent and um, sort of start, yeah, restart the, mm. the um, and open the minds and yes. restart the discussion yeah. on it.